from. Trap House. As we continue on the recruitment trail. Can't win them all though. But I'm not gonna jive you, man. Your boy Big Trap finds himself a bit perplexed on this one. Quick preamble. In no way, shape, form, or fashion am I disrespecting Chris or his decision. I wish the kid long, healthy, prosperous success in his pursuit of his degree and further accomplishments. Besides, Chris is a grown man, bro. 6'3", 295, ain't he from that red dirt? Nah, bro. Big Trap is too banged up and too long in the tooth to wrestle with this type of bear in a phone boot. Because when Big Chris get those mitts on you, bro, just tap the DJ on the shoulder, hit the lights, the party is over, bro. Losing this four-star in-state chaos creator, it hurts, man. Because these are the typical interior space eaters we're going to need to battle those physical offensive lines in the SEC. But I just find myself asking why. Why Florida? That program is in complete delusion and disarray. From the boosters all the way down to the fan base, man. But I do understand that Gainesville is a vibe. And these kids love a vibe, man. New scenery, different weather. You know, sometimes some kids just want something new. So I can't knock the decision, man. But I would have loved to see you in that crimson and cream, homie. We about to start producing some serious talent on the defensive side. Nick Bonito is going to be a first rounder, bro. We slowly but surely going to start matriculating those guys into the league. Take advantage, young recruits. We build it over here in Norman, bro. Look, I said my piece, Chrissy. Great, I... I tell you what, though, Sooner Nation. Props have to be given to Drew Hill, Coach Riley, the entire recruitment staff, bro. Because this 22 class is littered with talent. Currently ranked seventh in the nation on most composite sites. Gavin Sawchuck is looking like McCaffrey out there. Relique Brown is going to be a star, bro. Flat out splash player. Gentry Williams, another stud. The big homie Dendy bringing some of that Florida swamp juice down there to the prairie. I'm loving this class, bro. One hidden gem that isn't getting much press is Big Cedric Roberts, bro. Matter of fact, he is the only 2022 recruit that I haven't done a profile piece on. But he's another 6'3 monster that has immaculate footwork for someone of his stature. And he's a two-sport athlete. He gets up and down the court in basketball. He's got fluid hips, high motor. I like it, man. One thing I will say, though, is going to be up to the strength department to pack maybe 10 to 15 more pounds on his frame just to help him anchor down more to deal with this D1 talent that he's going to see at the next level. But I love this class, man. Jacob Sexton, Demetrius Hunter, littered with stars, man. Bryce, I mean, the future's looking real bright soon in the nation. So all we got to do is march on, man. March on down the field. I really do appreciate you guys tapping in with your boy Big Trap, liking the videos, sharing them. All that typical YouTube stuff, bro. But seriously, it's been one heck of a ride this season. And we ain't done yet. Let's take care of State. Put Sanders in the dirt. And let the chips fall where they may, bro. Boom, as soon. Season's greetings. Trap House. Bedlam.